So today, we are in Iowa. What's Iowa? I have no idea. But we came out here. We came last night. It was Friday. And we stayed with a relative and went to a brewery. I had a few too many IPAs. And now I am parched for coffee. Now, where would I find a cup of coffee in Iowa? I have no idea. I know how to find grass, farmland, but coffee? I feel like the world's largest truck stop might be able to help me out. Now, if you watched my last video, I went to Love's and I found myself the biggest Coke Zero and did not stop being Coke Zero the rest of that day. I also bought a hat. So now, we're at the world's largest truck stop. I have both my credit cards and a, 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 real, a real craving for some strong caffeination. So I figure we'll go in there, we'll get some snacks, try to find some merch, and hopefully find the world's largest truck stop coffee spot. Come on, let's go. Hey. Uh, this place is nuts. I am definitely, I don't know, I'm going to get something though. I like this color. I don't even, I don't even think I can film this whole store because there's too much to film guys. I'll try to just cut in what I think is cool. Absolutely need coffee. I, I'm just filming myself. I don't even care what people think. I'm absolutely losing it. Look, if you have children. You can buy toys and Barbies and I don't even know. That's bootleg Barbie right there. Do they actually have women like product? What's that word? Putters? Look at all this. You guys, I came for coffee, but now I'm gonna leave with a nice new shirt. Look at it, a new dish rag. Scrunchies. Oh my god, this is sick. Look at those. Love that. Oh my god, look at the shirts. Oh yeah. Definitely grabbing one of these. I just don't know which one. Who would have thought that there'd be a caribou coffee at the world's largest truck stop? And thank god, because I'm literally about to pop. And the person I'm with too, I think, really wants coffee. So, just wanted to fill you guys in and let you know what's up. And now we're just in line. I don't know if I'm gonna get a vanilla spice latte or a apple crumble dip. We'll see. <sighs> you know what's up. My aunt, my aunt used to go to Caribou Coffee every night for a what I would call cappuccino blast. It was literally like ice cream with coffee and whipped cream. And then uh, my uncle would get pissed off because for one, they were like seven bucks. And then also she was getting fat. And he said one night, I don't want a fat wife. And she got very upset, but she still kept getting them. And now you guys know the story. Two Splenda, a little bit of almond milk in my coffee. And then uh, my my partner got a, a, a cold brew with sweet vanilla. So we still have a, a lot to look at. Now you guys know, we found the coffee. One of the lot lizards told me, just find me in the lights. I think I found the lights. So obviously they have these lights here for the owner operators, but this is like a different level of what you do at a truck stop. I mean, literally, some guy here is making commission off the truckers that are just waking up and they see these pipes or these lights and they buy them. I can't imagine that they're at the cheapest prices. They're very smart. And then look at it. They just go to bed. That's why I'm not a truck driver. And where's that lot with them? Since she'd be in her tent. I use the steering wheel to drive my way right near your heart. I don't know if I'll use all that. Did you get my brothers and cousins up there? Oh, there they are. It's my big white family. I don't know how 
how they all fit in the one semi. Who gets top bunk? The little guys? What if the parents want to do something? How are they going to do that in a semi truck? Maybe they live in the hauler and it's heated and they turn into like a mini apartment and they just travel the road. They're white skin. This is like, it's literally movies that you just listen to. So if you want to pretend like you're blind, you can buy these. Otherwise, I don't, I don't know who would buy So this is where I end the video. I'm here at the Iowa 80 restaurant. I'm gonna get some food, hopefully it'll be okay. As you can tell, I'm hungover, so. Until next time. Cheddar broccoli, cheddar perfect. Broccoli. All right, thank you. And I'm gonna get cheddar broccoli soup, so now you know. <laughs> this is what we call eating that trucker lifestyle. You stop at your favorite truck stop, you get some broccoli cheddar, and just enjoy your life. That's why I wanna quit my job and do this full time. One day though. That's good.